A Grant County High School student is recovering after police say a man punched him until he was unconscious in a fit of road rage. Channel 2's Gwinnett County Bureau Chief Matt Johnson is live on Peachtree Industrial Boulevard. And Matt, you learned after doing some research here that the suspect has been in jail before. He's been charged with aggressive driving before, but nothing like what police say started right here at this intersection on Peachtree Industrial Boulevard in Sugar Hill. I spoke to the victim's father this afternoon. He says his son is recovering. He's back at high school already. They're just thankful this wasn't deadly. This is video that police used to track down the driver in the blue truck days after he's accused of attacking a teen until he was unconscious. Gwinnett County Police say the violent road rage attack led to the arrest of an adult and led to the injury of a high school student. He eventually lost consciousness, and when he awoke, he and his sister called 911 to report the incident. The teen victim told police that 57-year-old Dwayne Sutter flipped him off at Peachtree Industrial Boulevard and R.H. Smith Boulevard, so he flipped him off back. It was last Wednesday at around 2.30 in the afternoon when police say Sutterth drove his truck and followed the teen into a driveway on Buford Dam Road. The other driver pulled in behind him, approached him on the driver's side, and started to punch him through the driver's side window. Sutterth is also accused of making disturbing threats toward the victim's younger sister before he drove off. The suspect made threats to the victim that he was going to sexually assault who he thought was his girlfriend. Gwinnett County Police tracked down the suspect using flock cameras and arrested him Sunday. Jail records show Sutterth was arrested for aggressive driving in 2017 as well. Police say when dealing with an aggressive driver, it's best to ignore them. We encourage you to pull into a parking lot or pull over to the side of the road to let the other motorists proceed. Now, this suspect remains in jail without bond. He's facing eight charges, including aggressive driving and aggravated assault. Live in Gwinnett County, Matt Johnson, Channel 2 Action News. There are cameras everywhere watching your every move, and those flock cameras really came through on this one, Matt. Thank you.